Cheapskate. What's up, my name is Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in this video, I wanted to talk about five stocks that are under $10 with a huge potential to at least double or maybe even uh, you know triple in the next uh, few months or when this market recovers. Again, um, these are stocks that really had some really good runs. And then with this pullback, they didn't only pull back, but pull back hard. So right now, if we can get a bounce off of uh, the lows and then ride it back up to where they were trading before, it would be a good gain. So that's what I want us to talk in today's video. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest, and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and your notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So guys, again, these are stocks that have actually struggled with this little pullback. Again, you go when I go through the stocks, you will see it. A lot of people um, during this time, when they see stocks pulling back like this, what they do is some people sell and, and run and some people don't even want to touch it. And so if you are a seasoned trader or a seasoned investor, you know that each time there is a dip in the market, you have one or two things you can do. You can add to your long-term position or you can find uh, string trade opportunities. So in this case, some of these stocks are ones that you can potentially hold long term and the other ones are stocks that you can potentially swing trade so i'm going to walk through it and i'll tell you which ones i think are long-term opportunities and the ones that i think are swing trade opportunities so let's jump right in and kind of take a look uh, at these different stocks so the first one here is ticket symbol nndm that's nano dimension um, this is a company that actually um, provides kind of a 3D printing for a, a electronic circuit board uh, based out of Israel. So uh, this is a company. I, I like the uh, the model, the fact that they're doing this additive um, manufacturing. So it pretty much 3D printing. I like them for swing trade uh, for long term. If you're looking for a 3D printing company for long term, I prefer again. This is my preference. I prefer Desktop Matter ticket symbol DM. So you can go check them out. I like that one better than this, but uh, um, I, I'll take nano dimensions just for a quick, uh, a quick swing trade and uh, just to make some good profit. So if you can see here, if we can go back here about a month, this stock was up there at about $16 and then it's just kind of pulled back um, since then and then with this crash. So I'm hoping to get that bounce. Even if we see here when the market opens, see this thing pulled down to $6 before squeezing back up again and sitting around that $7. So somewhere around here would be a good place for you to start um, opening up a position and, and riding this thing all the way so that's one i like number two here is ticket symbol bng or bio nano uh, genomics again this is another one that i've talked about here on the channel and so if you are looking to get into the space of uh biogenomics this is a good one uh again they're actually engaged in uh genomic uh, analysis so they just kind of went from zero to 100 overnight. So that's why I want you guys to kind of take a look at the stock because when this stock started, you can see here it was trading, it was a penny stock back in December of 20, um, uh, December of 2020. Look at that, under 50 cents. And then it just took off and never looked back, got to a high of close to about $16 before pulling back. So again, this one, I would say anything under uh, $6 is a good place for you to start, open up a position. And then even if you can ride this one back up to $10 and then you can definitely take some profit there. But I like this company long-term. So I can definitely want to hold this one um, long-term if you don't have a position yet. But again, if you can get it down to six, $5, open up a position there. Um, that would be a great one to ride um, all the way. Next one is Foresight Autonomous. Again, this is one that provides uh, maybe accident prevention um, solutions or products. So the, the, the company says their product works better than LiDAR technology because it can actually dictate uh, objects in cloudy weather because of the way that the, the, their product is designed. Whereas um, LiDAR technology needs light and needs visibility for people to actually dictate object this one can see an object in the cloudy situation before the object even gets uh, to be visible so I like the idea of the technology right now it's just a concept but I do like it so this is one that we can definitely swing trade if you can see here pull down to four dollars and thirty cents before ripping back up all the way to sitting right now at six dollars and thirteen cents so even if you you cut this bottom right here and write it up that is a two dollar spread which is huge in this crazy market so I like foresight to tell them was the ticket symbol FRSX um, then the other one I like to is isoray 
Again, I, I did a detailed video here on the channel where I talked about ISO Ray, guys. Um, definitely go check it out. Medicare, uh, the device company that is actually doing what we call isotope based uh, treatment for cancer and different forms of cancer. So um, I like their, their technology. I like what they uh, the product that they have. Uh, one of their key products called the uh, Cesium 131 is the first of its kind in the market. And so again, they're just trying to introduce this. And as soon as more and more people start to feel comfortable for uh, using this uh, for treatment over um, what we call chemical therapies right now, this would definitely, or, or radiology, this would definitely uh, step in the right direction and push this company in the spotlight. So I like this one. Again, ticket symbol ISR Isoray. This one to me is long term. I have a position that I'm just holding long term. If I see again like this dip, I missed it because I, I, I wasn't on my computer. This would have been a good spot for me to add to my position under a dollar. Man, look at that. So, but I'm going to keep adding again just to build a good solid position. Um, and then last but not the least here is ticket symbol KUL. Are. This one is over the counter, so that's why I'm showing it here. So over the counter OTC, these are stocks that don't trade on the NASDAQ. So these ones, they trade on other exchanges. So you need seasoned um, or brokers like Vanguard, Fidelity, TD Ameritrade to get access to this. And some of those, I think TD Ameritrade, you have to pay a commission about $6.30 and, and to trade um, over the counter stocks like this. But I do like cooler technology. If you can see this whole crash didn't even impact the company and in any shape or form they're still holding strong and i like this one again when things finally settle there is a good catalyst out there that is supposed to drive the price of this stock up because um the rover the rover that just landed on mass has uh cooler technology on it protecting the battery that it's going to power that rover um in mass so i like this one uh for long term again the ticket symbol is k u l r so there you go, guys. Those are five stocks that I'm actually watching right now that I see um, an opportunity for a swing trader, opportunity for, for long term. So you can decide uh, which ones you want to hold long term and which one you want to swing. And again, when you are going into a swing trade, guys, I want you to have a game plan. I want you to have an entry price. I want you to have an exit price. And I want you to have a cut loss price. If you're going to a swing trade, you say, let's say, for instance, your entry price is $5. And then you say your stop loss would be four dollars and fifty cents or four dollars and then you see you take profit is eight dollars or nine dollars and then once you go into that trade you start to observe it you can look at the trade and see if it's going the wrong way then you cut your losses and get out if it's going in the positive way you have to make sure that when it hits your price take that profit or put in a trailing stop to secure any profit from there moving forward. Again, that's the reason why most people complain that they've, they've, they've lost money in the market because when you were green, you thought that green lasted forever. I mean, the market give it, the market take it. The minute the money enters into your account or you see your account going, if it's a swing account, secure the profit. The only profit that you can count on in the market is one that you've secured. If you haven't secured the profit, it can just disappear like that in a heartbeat. So again, I'm really trying as much as possible to drive this point home so that you guys know that securing profit means a lot in the market. Don't count your X before the hash. That is just pretty much what I want, I want to let you guys know. Again, guys, let me know in the comment section, which stocks under $10 are you most excited about or are you buying? Let me know in the comment section. If you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Also, if you're looking to get started with investing, Weibo has their promotion where if you sign up and deposit $100, you get free stocks, links in the description below. And as always, guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage and stay motivated.